Is this new limited release rye whiskey the best value amongst rye whiskeys out there on the market right now? That's a good question, and I'm going to try to help you answer that here in this video. Welcome back into the Whiskey Weather YouTube channel, everybody. I am Brandon. I'm a TV meteorologist in Cincinnati, Ohio, giving you the latest reviews and forecasts and trends going on in the whiskey world, trying to help you save from spending your hard-earned money on bottles of whiskey and bourbon that aren't worth it, but also trying to steer you in the right direction on bottles to search for as you head out to the next liquor store. Now, the first time I saw this bottle, this is Bullet 95 12-Year Rye, so it's a 12 year old whiskey. The first time I saw that was on my bourbon hunt through northern Kentucky all the way down through Tennessee which you can find up there on the top right and I was a little intrigued because I was like I haven't seen this in years. Is this the same thing? Well Bullet put out a 12 year old whiskey back in 2019. It was short-lived. It was a limited edition and they sold out and now we've got another one. It's again a Bullet 95 Rye, 12 year old rye whiskey. Now you see 95, you might think that's 95 proof, $95. It's because the Nashville is 95% rye. So that's the 95.5 rye. It comes from MGP. And I'm going to put this out there up front, folks. I didn't do a whole lot of research on this. I'm going to break down the fourth wall. I've been going through a pretty rough patch in my life right now, trying to get things all sorted. You may notice a different spinner speakeasy if you're a, uh, an avid whiskey weather viewer. Um, trying to get my life in gear, haven't had a whole lot of time, but still want to give you guys some great reviews and great thoughts on whiskey. So if you have appreciated all of that, please don't forget to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button as we're going to be doing some future forecasts and bourbon hunts down the road as well. But this Bullet 12-Year Rye, I haven't done a whole lot of research on it, but what I did do some research on, you find out that there's actually 17-year-old rye whiskey in this. And my favorite part of this whole thing is this bottle, the MSRP is $54.99. So a great value for 12 years old. Nowadays, the general rule would be about $10 for every year. So you would think that a 12 year old rye whiskey would be coming in right around 120 bucks. Not this one, $54.99. I actually grabbed this at my Costco here in Northern Kentucky for about $47.98 or something along those lines. I'll throw the picture of the receipt in the, uh, in the video here. But again, 12 year old rye whiskey, 95.5. This comes in at a 92 proof, 46 ABV on the bottle right there, green label, 12 year old risk, rye whiskey coming from Bullet. Now Bullet does source this from MGP. They supposedly have a contract where they get to control everything, whether they're going to be aging this at MGP or out there in, uh, at Bullet's Distillery. So it says, distilled in Lawrenceburg, Indiana, bottled by Bullet Distilling Company in Louisville, Kentucky. Uh, again, that's really all we got on the bottle. 12 years old. Already getting a pretty good whiff of it. It smells delicious. Man, um some woodsiness to it. The, the oak comes through 12 years on the nose. A little bit of mint. Some fresh cut grass almost. It smells like the an orange rind. Like not the orange itself but the outside of an orange that you would put into an old fashioned. Mint. Some brown sugar. Caramel. But yeah, that mint and orange really come through to me. It's a very sweet nose. It's got a summer feeling to it. I think this would be a great summer smelling whiskey. Let's see what it tastes like. Mm. Okay. It's got like a peach to it, uh, a peach grassiness. I get some of the brown sugar and the caramel. It's about as sweet on the palate as I think it is on the nose. 92 proof, so it's not blowing you away. There's a little bit of that rye spice there. It's not quite as tingly on the sides as I usually get with some ryes. Overall, very good. Vanilla's starting to come through as I'm talking. That oak now really starting to pull through. I'm getting more of that oakiness the more that I talk. So that finish, 
It's still going. For 92 proof, this it's not packing a punch, but it's lingering a lot more than some of those lower proofers get. Mm. It's actually really good, guys. I'm pretty blown away. Best part of this is it's $47 at Costco. Um, and everywhere else I've seen it's for like 55 bucks. Uh, very good. If you're a fan of bourbon and you're trying to get in the rye game, this Bullet 95 rye is probably a great starting point, especially for a 12 years old and approachable. It's affordable. Uh, honestly, I think it's one of the better ryes out there, especially if you are a bourbon fan who hasn't really loved ryes. I think this would be a great kind of transition rye. And also the value on this, let's think about it. A 12-year-old rye whiskey coming in at 55 bucks. Michter's 10-year rye, which is also 92 proof, comes in at about $200. So the value here, phenomenal. If you're trying to find the 12-year-old Michter, or the 10-year-old Michter's, this is two years older. This is a 12-year-old whiskey. So I would say if you find this, go and grab one. I don't think you're going to be disappointed. And even if you don't like rye and you end up not liking this, this would make a phenomenal cocktail rye. Uh, whether that's a Manhattan, an old fashioned, and you're not wasting a bunch of money because it's only 55 bucks. Overall, this is one of the best value ryes that I have seen out there, that I've tasted out there. And overall, I would say it is a fantastic pour to go try and grab. So if you're a fan of rye, if you're a fan of bourbon, I think both of you will be enjoying this. But uh, if you're a huge rye fan, I do think this misses a little bit of that. There's a little bit more to kind of hope for with this that it just doesn't fulfill if you're a huge rye fan, but I don't think you're going to be disappointed that you bought it. So go head out. Like I said, the forecast on this one is very, very good. Before we go anywhere, I do want to mention that this video was brought to you by Jacob Bromwell um, and their flasks. If you are a fan of flasks or you need a flask for an event, or I think these would make a great groomsman's gift or a Father's Day gift though that we're coming up. Uh, it's kind of a high class um, flask. Uh, very well made, handmade, and very great quality. Uh, I've got a link on the, in the description below and in the comments if you'd like to purchase one of those as well. But the big deal, the big thing that I'm saying, this Bullet 12 Year Rye, the Bullet 95 Rye 12 Year Frontier Whiskey, Straight rye whiskey, 95.5 rye. Yeah, uh, I think it's a slam dunk when it comes to the, one of the best value ryes out there on the market. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, hope you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future forecasts and future bourbon hunts. I always end my videos the same way. Wherever you are, it is always whiskey weather. Please drink responsibly, friends, and go find this bullet 12 year rye. It is fantastic. Please drink responsibly. And if you enjoyed this video, hopefully you're going to enjoy some of my other videos. Go check those out right there on the top right of your screen. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and we'll see you in the next video. Cheers, y'all.